Today, we are going to be doing a fidget shopping challenge that I have never done before on my channel, and I am so excited about it. So as you guys can tell by the title and the thumbnail and my outfit of the day, today we are going to be looking for tie-dye fidgets only inside of Learning Express. Honestly, I cannot believe that I didn't do this video sooner because I was thinking about it, and there are literally so many tie-dye poppets and slimes and just tie-dye fidgets in general. So when I had this idea, it was literally like a light bulb moment and I could not wait to go out and film this. So here we are now, I am all dressed up for the occasion and I am going to guess that we are going to walk out with 27 tie-dye fidgets. Now, honestly, that's a pretty high guess. That might be a little too high. I'm just super optimistic and I personally have a bunch of tie-dye fidgets in my collection because I was looking before I left to go film this and I have tons of tie-dye poppets. So I'm crossing my fingers that we will have good luck in here today. But before we get started, I have a challenge for all of you watching. I wanna see if you guys can like, click subscribe, and turn on post notifications in just five seconds. I hope you guys are ready because here goes the countdown. Five, four, three, two, one. Time's up. If you guys were successfully able to complete the five second challenge, then I want you to comment down below. Comment below your guess about how many tie-dye fidgets you think I'm going to find today. And it'll be super fun to see if anybody got close or if anyone actually guesses the exact number of fidgets that we found. But anyways, you guys, without further ado, we are going to go inside of the store right now to begin this challenge. And I hope that you'll enjoy watching. So let's go inside. All right, guys, here we go. I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, literally right in the window display, there's a tie-dye TY. And I think I saw tie-dye Squishmallow over there too. All right, guys, so we're gonna grab a basket and instantly I already found these 3D purse poppets that are tie-dye. So these are perfect. Oh my gosh, we're already adding something to the basket and we've literally just got into the store. They also have this really pretty tie-dye bunny purse. So there's green, blue, white. Comment below which one of these you guys would prefer, the first one or the second one. Personally, I like this one more, but they're both super pretty. Oh my gosh, guys, another tie-dye fidget. What, are you kidding me? This is crazy. See, I can't believe I didn't do this challenge sooner. So that's already number three. Let's see if we can find any more. Okay, that's a striped one. Oh my gosh, guys, more tie-dye. This is so crazy. Having a lot of luck finding tie-dye poppets. We still have so much to look through. So far, so good. Mm, wait, this one's tricky. Would you guys count this as tie-dye or more like striped? I really don't know. Mm, I feel like it's not really tie-dye, it's more striped, but it's still a super cool find. Also though, I don't really know if it would be considered a fidget. It's like, it's kind of like a bouncy ball. I don't know, some people think they're fidgets, some people don't, but we're just gonna pass for now. How about tangles? They're more striped. These little caterpillars are so cool. Oh look, they have mini ones too. That is so fun. <gasps> Guys, okay, literally all of these 3D Poppet turtles would count for this challenge. Wait, they're literally all stuck together. Hang on, okay, wait, this one is, this one's free. He's a free man. Okay, so we're gonna get him. We are going to get this one as well. It's like camo. And then, wait, I need this one. So this one just does not wanna come off of the keychain, but that's okay. We got these three and they are super duper beautiful. I think my favorite 3D turtle pop is probably this one. It's super vibrant and I'm just obsessed. Let's keep going. We're gonna go around the corner here. I found another tie-dye thing, you guys. It did not take long at all. And look, they're stuck together. These are owls and look how cute. Whenever you squeeze it, the eyeballs pop out. So we have to get this one. And is this the same thing? No, this is definitely different. This one reminds me of the fluffy stuffed cotton candy. So let's add these to the basket. Okay, I kid you not, I just found even more tie-dye fidgets. You guys, we are literally hitting the jackpot today. Wow. Okay, so every single one of these pop it dice would count, okay? So there's this one. This one's super pretty, the blue and the pink. Then there's the yellow and orange. 
This one is navy blue and white. Wow, this is so satisfying. And then also, these would count too, literally. Guys, usually I have to hunt quite a bit with these challenges, but again, I can't believe I didn't do this challenge until now because there's literally so much tie-dye. All right, so we're gonna get one of these red tie-dye uh, pop-it keychains. We're gonna get red and blue. I don't think we got this one yet. No, we got something similar. See? And then these little flippy octopus. Oh my gosh, look. Every single one of these counts as well. All right, you guys have to let me know which one is your favorite. Okay, so this is octopus number one, octopus number two, and then this is octopus number three. I haven't really seen any tie-dye stress balls. Maybe we'll find some. There's even more of these little tie-dye octopus and we don't have this color combo yet. So we're gonna get this one. Okay guys, I just got super excited because I remember all this slime they have and there is so much tie-dye slime. Okay, so there's this Christmas swirl cake. How do we feel about this? I feel like it's not really super tie-dye. It's kind of like, I'm on the fence about it, but we're definitely not desperate right now. So I think we're gonna put that one back, but this one would definitely qualify. It's called Rainbow Frost. This would count as well, especially if you mix it up like a little bit, it'll be even more tie-dye. The Robin's Egg Frost. I have this one at home already. It's so beautiful. So I think that's it for slimes. And they have all these tangles. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. This one lights up. They still have so many Easter fidgets, but none of them are tie-dye. Trust me, I would know because I bought literally all of them. So in this little red bucket, there's 3D pop it change purses. So we're gonna get this blue one for sure. We're gonna get this rainbow one. Let's add those to the basket. And then there's a ton of poppets back here. Hmm, and there's also some dimple keychains. Don't see any tie-dye. This is like striped and there's a rainbow tie-dye fidget in here, but I don't wanna buy the entire pack just for that one. Oh, guys, this pizza right here, this is tie-dye because look in the center. Yes, the crust isn't tie-dye, but the pizza part is. So that counts. Oh, guys, these are so neat. Look at these snappers. Why is it not snapping? Oh, it's one of those where it gets stuck and then you have to turn it and then unsnap it. This one to me looks tie-dye, so we're gonna get that one. <gasps> I forgot about these, pop it balls. So this is a patriotic one. We're gonna get this one and we're gonna get this one. And then there's one more tie-dye. Look how pretty. And then the rest are solid yellow. So we're gonna throw those in there. And then this is one of the last sections that we have to check. So this is like all Nitos pretty much. There's glow in the dark, shimmer. I love atomic Nitos so much. They're one of my favorite types of Nitos. Actually, they're probably my number one favorite type of Nito. Wait, actually, there's swirl Nitos. I don't know if they have swirl Nitos here, but if they do, then those would definitely count for this challenge. However, I am not seeing them. That is okay though, because we found literally so many other things. So as you know, earlier in the video, I found this super cool tie-dye poppet dice, and I just found so many more of those in different colors. Look at this, oh my gosh, I am obsessed with these colors. It is so beautiful. So we're gonna add that. Okay, also look at the basket. That is like the prettiest sight I have ever seen. All right, and then we have this one and the look of this reminds me of melted crayons. And then we're going to also grab these two. Seriously, I cannot get over how beautiful this is. Okay, you guys, so I am finally finished going through the entire store and I found so many tie-dye fidgets. P.S. If you want to, let me know in the comments how many times I said the word tie-dye in this video because I feel like I said it about 100 times. <laughs> but we are going to count and see how many we found. I think I found way more than 27, which was my OG guess. If I had to guess again, I would say I found 43. But again, comment your guesses below and we will see who came closest or maybe someone that's watching is a super good guesser and you'll guess the exact number. I don't know, but we're gonna find out right now. All right, you guys, let's start counting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 
12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33. Oh my goodness, we found 33 tie-dye fidgets in this video. I just can't get over the beauty of this pile. And if I had to choose my top three favorite items, you know we always do this at the end. Oh, okay, this is so tricky. Hmm, okay, well, I really love this 3D Poppet Owl because it does so many cool things. Like, its eyes pop out and it's just super satisfying it's beautiful and i've always wanted this one so this is one of my favorites also i like the turtle if i had to choose one more these octopus are always super fun yeah they're super cute and they remind me of summertime i remember when i first saw these out when fidgets started to become a trend it was the most exciting feeling ever so those are my three favorites but make sure you guys comment down below and let me know what your top three favorite fidgets are but you guys that was all for today's video if you enjoyed it then please don't forget to give a big thumbs up make sure you let me know in the comments below what your favorite fidget finds of the day were and i will talk to you in the next video bye Mwah.